How to enlarge text on a web page. Let me open up Google Chrome. I've got Wikipedia up. Um, if you've ever opened a web page and uh, the text is teeny and you find yourself leaning into the screen to read, uh, I think that's the wrong way to surf the internet. I like to relax in my chair, even lean back in my chair, and uh, surf the internet. That's how I read books, relaxed in my chair. So, how enlarge text on a web page is uh, by the shortcut key, Control Plus, on the keyboard. Demonstrate it right here. It makes it very large, and I can actually lean back in my chair and uh, relax and read. And I use a mouse wheel in the center to, uh, to scroll down the text and up the text. Um, this shortcut also works in Firefox, as I'm going to demonstrate here. Control plus, nice and large. Firefox is my second choice for a browser. It's got a lot of great add-ons. It's just slower than Chrome. So you know, I switch back and forth between Firefox and Chrome. But I like Chrome a lot more all the time because they keep improving it. And the shortcut also works in Internet Explorer, which I didn't even know where it was on my computer. I never use it. So I had to find it for this video. But it works. Control plus. in Internet Explorer 2. Internet Explorer is a magnet for viruses. It's slow. I it don't like it. I never use it. So I'll just shut it down. Now um, I'll go back to Chrome and uh, sometimes when you enlarge something, something you want to see on the right side of the screen will be cut off. And you can see that from this bar that something on the right is cut off. Button the wheel. I could depress it and I get arrows up, down, left, right. And if I move the mouse right, I can go right and usually see ads on the right. Go back left, up, and down. I don't use that very much. I use the free spinning mouse wheel that I have. I'll read the article. I want to go back to the top quickly, so I'll just spin the wheel and it'll zoom back up to the top. And I can navigate. Um, that's how to enlarge text on a web page.